What is up investors, Jason here. So in this video, we're gonna be talking about the cryptocurrency known as Ripple or under its symbol XRP. Now, if you have, if you have not been watching the coin market cap recently and notice that Ripple has just surpassed not just Solana, but also Cardano. Currently, XRP is the sixth largest cryptocurrency by market cap. Now, for everybody that has been bullish on XRP, this is great news. Now, for the people that are not familiar with XRP, XRP is a cryptocurrency that has had a bit of drama and it has had a lot of shade thrown at it by the SEC. So in this video, I'm going to be doing a little bit of an analysis on XRP, as well as talking about what currently is going on and what do we expect with XRP and the SEC. So as we get to it, if you guys don't mind, please do me a huge favor. Please be sure to smash, destroy, annihilate, or just gently press that like button to help me out with the YouTube algorithm and help spread this video to more people that might find it interesting. Now, for everybody that has never seen me before, I talk about the stock market, mostly tech-based stocks, and as well as cryptocurrencies, and I focus on high market cap cryptocurrencies. So with that being said, subscribe if you are interested in content like this, and now let's get to it. Now, we recently just seen XRP trend upwards pretty quickly. Now, over these last few days, we've been having green days with it, which is great. And we're seeing a lot more volume activity jumping in. And this is also helping things out. Now, there is some stuff coming up with the SEC here soon, which could be part of a lot of the bullish behavior that we're seeing within it at this moment. But the main things that we need to be paying attention to are the supports and resistance that we currently have. Now, we just saw it rise up above 85 cents. And currently, this is a good resistance point. It, it has plenty of history between the price of 85 cents and $1, which $1 is going to be a very key point of resistance that we're going to approach if we can continue holding on to support above 85 cents. Now, Looking at the past history here, between $0.85 cents and $1, we can see many times in the past where when it had fallen below $1, it did show a lot of signs of support there at $0.85. Cents. So hopefully that's going to be the case again in this scenario if it is continued to run up. Now, a little bit of background about the whole controversy that's going on with the SEC and XRP is that in December of 2020, Ripple Labs Incorporated and two of its executives were sued by the U.S. Security and Exchange Commission for selling XRP tokens, which the SEC classified as unregistered securities. Now, the whole drama that's currently going on started in December of 2020 when the SEC sued Ripple Labs Incorporated, which is responsible for XRP, was sued by the SEC as well as two of Ripple Labs executives. And for the reason is for selling what the SEC is claiming to be unregistered securities. So to fast forward to now, XRP gains 30% after Ripple gets permission to explain fair notice defense versus the SEC. Now, Ripple was just granted permission by a judge to respond to the SEC's memorandum of law support for motion to strike fair notice defense according to court documents. Now, this judge also ordered the unsealing of three documents concerning the SEC versus Ripple case, including Ripple CEO Brad Garlinghouse's email thread and deposition notice and founder Chris Larson's email string. Now, the judge, Annalisa Torres of Manhattan, ordered these documents to be unsealed on February 17th. Now, once these are released, these documents will show that in 2012, Ripple received a legal analysis that XRP was not an investment contract. And this is according to XRP's legal counsel. Now, they're also saying that the fact that it took the SEC eight years to suggest they disagreed with that analysis while XRP traded in a massive global market is baffling. Now, this lawsuit, the SEC versus Ripple, is a very serious one for cryptocurrencies, and it could really say a lot for how the future of cryptocurrencies are regulated. So there was a lot really riding on this, not just for for XRP, but for the entire crypto market in general. How could Bitcoin be one thing and the XRP be a different thing? And that's those are those things that need to be discussed and figured out. Now, if we look at the 
crypto market cap here and we look at where XRP currently is. Like I said in the beginning of the video that XRP had just recently passed Solana and Cardano and now is the sixth largest cryptocurrency by market cap. Now, if we look at these last seven days, XRP is up more than 40%. And it's not the only cryptocurrency that is making some big moves. I mean, we have a lot of the cryptocurrencies making some big moves right now, but as far as all coins go, XRP is just following what Shiba Inu did, which Shiba Inu currently is up 46% over these last seven days. And a lot of these altcoins are really moving, but some are moving more so than others. And XRP is really kicking things off as well as Shiba Inu with the whole crypto market cap. We're seeing a lot of things transitioning over in the crypto market and a lot of big things you know, going on. And this is all news that helps make the crypto market more bullish. Now, hopefully we get some good news with everything that's going on with XRP and this this whole drama with the SEC, uh, hopefully that can just go to the wayside and things can t continue being bullish as they are. If not, this could be a big hit for the entire crypto market. And I wouldn't be surprised if you wouldn't see a lot of these altcoins possibly taking a bit of a hit as well. And especially ones like Cardano and Solana and possibly even Ethereum. This could this could set waves if it doesn't go good for XRP. But anyways, I'd like to hear everybody's thoughts and opinions. Now, I think that this this might possibly go by the wayside, but who knows when we're talking about things like this. But all in all, I think it's going to be really good to watch what does happen. And I definitely like the bullish behavior of the crypto market. And I think that there's a lot to really watch with XRP. I think that we're going to see some big breakouts if it is able to find support above the price of $1. I think that there's a lot to really watch here and a lot to really continue. But with that being said, I like to hear everybody's thoughts and opinions about what is currently going on. So please like, share, comment, and subscribe. New videos coming out on my channel all the time. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you all in the next video coming very soon.